The Allegheny Journal has found an interesting character here this morning, which is Tuesday, December 5th, and it's Gary Spradlin, who along with his wife Jennifer, has come up with a really cool set of events for this weekend at the Clifton Forge Armory. It'll be December 9th and December 10th. Welcome, Gary. Yeah, thank you. Gary, is, Gary and Jennifer have come up with a fundraiser set of events to benefit Matt Wilmer and Emily Byer, two local cancer uh, victims. And Gary's here to talk about this cool weekend and some of the things that will be going on. What's going on, Gary? Uh, we've got a lot of stuff going on. Um, we actually expanded it to two days rather than one. Um, Three o'clock on Saturday, December 9th, we'll have uh, a pulled pork dinner, uh, basically be directly following the the Iron Gate Parade, Christmas Parade. So after the Iron Gate Parade, you can get first class pulled mm -hmm. pork. We'll be handing flowers out um, during the parade or, after, or shortly after the parade. Uh, we've also got Santa Claus will be there from four o'clock till six. Uh, then we have a paint night scheduled, uh, a couple bands, Will Atkins will sing from six to seven. Explain it, just for a moment, for somebody not c perfectly uh, attuned to what a paint night is, what is, what is paint uh, night? Basically what it is, is um, uh, it's, it's going to be with Tanya Hazelwood. Basically what it is, is she will bring all the supplies in and she'll have a picture and she will and, you know, guide a certain, like a little classroom to uh, just do the picture. Almost like a painting class in fun, huh? Basically, that's what it is. Okay. I think we've, we've got room for 10. I think we have seven, so we can take three more people. And that's part of the overall fundraising. Exactly, okay. yeah. And uh, then uh, at, from 7.30 to 9, we will have high contract uh, bluegrass band out of Buena Vista. There'll be vendors all day, 50-50 uh, drawing. That's really cool. Uh, that's Saturday. So each of these fun events has a small bit of a fundraising goal with it, yes. which, which is going to push you towards this total. I yeah. think Gary has indicated he's already raised three or four thousand dollars, and yeah. what you're hoping is if you get the right amount of public participation, you could even get as high as seven or ten thousand. Yeah, the goal is ten thousand, so that that's what we're reaching for. So wow, we'll we'll see how that goes, but so far it's off to a really good start. That's great. Um, then, then Sunday we've got the doors to open at, at 10 o'clock on Sunday. Um, we've got rhinestone rockers, um, Patty's Dance Studio, a couple different uh, dancing troops coming in. Will that be clogging and other interesting no, they're, things? they're like just going to be dancing. Uh, the, okay. Due to the floor, we couldn't really get a clogging group in. Okay. We do have, um, it's going to be the Rebels of Rhythm. Um, they're going to come in from 2 to 3 and clog outside. So we. Okay. We had to move them outside due to the floor, which we hate to do it. They're really good. We saw them yeah, at yeah, uh, really we saw them at yeah. Dothet Park not too long ago. Yeah, and then we have a, a pretty good sized cornhole tournament. It's going to start at twelve thirty, which is going to be uh, it's going to be a lot of teams. So that's going to be nice. Um, we're giving away two cornhole two sets of cornhole boards and a hundred dollars each to the winners. And don't you have some interesting raffle items as well? Yeah, we've got uh, we've got a thirty out six, a nine millimeter pistol. Um, We've got a hog hunt at Green uh, Mountain Meadows in Greenville, West Virginia. Um, I'm giving away a free mount and a Yeti cooler. There's several. There's and we've got over. We've got probably 150 smaller door prizes to give away during the wow. day. Wow! I mean, that really these these two days are going to be fun and action packed for sure. We've got. We've also got. Um, Tim Smith from the Moonshiners. We've got him confirmed coming sometime after lunch on Sunday. Wow. So we've got him, actually I got the email the other day confirming that he will be there. Uh, that's really cool. We don't know the exact time yet because he's traveling through the area. He's just, you know, due to traffic, but he will be there for sure. And um, then just at, from 12 to 5 o'clock on Sunday, we'll be giving door prizes away. Approximately 5 to 10 every half an hour. We'll be doing 5 to 10 drawings every half an hour. So we've got a lot of door prizes. A lot of nice dual prizes. Gary and Jennifer have put together a great two-day weekend. For those of you who in your heart may have a few extra bucks that you'd like to put towards a great cause, it's all happening at the Clifton Forge Armory this weekend. And Gary and Jennifer, along with several other associates, have really worked hard to make this a tremendous success. And we hope it'll be in your hearts to be able to join them this weekend and help raise money for two really cool people. 
Yeah. Thanks very much for joining us today, Garrett. No problem. Thank you for having me.